What's up, everyone? Happy Monday, fun day, sunny Monday, down here at the South Pond of Hempstead Lake State Park. I found a new spot. I'm constantly exploring. Uh, this spot here, coming from the side street over here into the woods, is a little pipeline going here, old school brick pipeline. And the water's flowing over here, coming out. Cool little spot. That's Peninsula Boulevard up over there. And uh, Lakeview Avenue there. So I'm in the back over here, those of you who know the area. And uh, we're doing a ride, sunny ride. Um, did some errands this morning, showed a property, got some real estate stuff later. I uh, got my podcast tonight. And uh, I got to get you the message of the day before it gets too late. So um, let's just do a podcast, uh, Pastor Rick. And he talked about being an agent of mercy. Being an agent of mercy. Um, being kind to those around us. Um, we don't know what people are going through. A lot of people have a smile on their face and they're fighting a battle behind the scenes. And the best thing that we can do for someone, the biggest gift that we can give someone is our time and our patience and our understanding. Um, agents of mercy. Time is the most valuable commodity on earth. You can't buy it. You can't replace it. You can't get it back. So when you give your time to someone to help them, to listen to them, to console them, to have fun with them, to go to their events, um, we are given the biggest gift you can give. And we are being agents of mercy. Um, something to really think about. Who do you give your time to? Um, there was a, he was talking about a story where um, uh, he was talking to a dad, and I'm guilty of this myself. Dad was saying, I gave my kids everything. I gave my family everything. I give them, you know, a nice house to live in. I give them a nice car to drive in. I give them vacations. I give them all this other stuff. But the one thing he wasn't giving them, and I'm guilty of this myself, was time. Because we're so caught up in the hustle that we don't give them time. We don't... Uh, dedicate the most valuable thing that we can give to someone is time, patience, and understanding. So, in the course of your day, um, figure out where you're spending your time and who you're spending your time with, and give people the biggest gift you can give them, time, listen, understand. So, yesterday, I don't know if you guys saw the pictures, um, I went to a new friend in my life, Maria Lint, uh, introduced me by another friend, David Gusson. Um, Maria is a fellow real estate agent, I mentioned her before, and she had a event, um, Festival of Song, uh, it's an Italian heritage event, and she does it every year, and it was started by her mom, and her mom passed, uh, I believe it was seven years ago, and she kept the tradition going, and it was an awesome event, lots of fun, uh, lots of singing and dancing and good food and good people, lots of great conversations, and... Um, I met some new friends. Uh, I'm always networking. I met some cool people. Uh, I definitely would connect further. Um, but I was talking to uh, one person there, and we were talking about uh, our kids. And, of course, I got six kids. And uh, she said she has three kids. And then she went on to tell me that um, her, her youngest uh, child, her son, uh, died at 20 years old in the Navy, gave his life for the country. And... Man, that hits hard. That hits hard. Losing a, losing a child. Um, he was in the Navy, and God bless our troops. But um, she, uh, she's struggling. She's struggling. And um, we connected, and I swear God puts us all on each other's path for a reason. And um, I told her I'm here to lean on. She wants to talk or whatever. Um, but really, really puts in perspective life, how fragile it is. So hug your kids. Um, spend time with them. Time passes fast. The most valuable, valuable thing you can give your family is your time. So give your family time. All right. There's your message of the day. Go be an agent of mercy. Give some time. All right, let's pray. Your Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
Now lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to uh, realize what's important. Help us to be agents of mercy. Help us to spend time with those who need it. Spend time with our family, and don't waste time. We spend a lot of time wasting. We waste a lot of time in our lives, and uh, we should be giving that time to people around us. It's the biggest gift we can give is ourselves, and our time, and our understanding, and our patience, and uh, our care. So uh, think about that. So, all right, everyone. There's your message of the day. It's a beautiful sunny day. 50 something degrees. Get outside, enjoy it. Go for a bike ride. I'm going to finish this ride. Hope we're going to get a new listing this afternoon. Uh, see what happens with that. All good stuff. Um, into April now. Easter's coming. One weather's coming, thank God. And uh, that's it. It's time for us to spend some more time with our friends and family. Give that gift. Be there. Be present. Put the phone down. Give them your full attention time. All right, everyone. God bless. Have a great day. Put your head on a pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go.